Man, I shouldn't have did that. What's going on guys, it's your boy James here, Beards and Cars, back with another video. And in this video, guys, what I wanna talk about is my previous video where I trimmed my beard. Do I have any regrets? So as I just got through trimming my beard in that video, I did have a little bit of what did I just do? I shouldn't have did that, all right? In my mind, over the years, I've always known that I wanted to go back at some point in time to like this length, all right? Like maybe like a 12 month beard length or something like that. But uh, I just never did it. So I grew past that, which was a good thing. And then I trimmed back to this and I'll probably grow back out, you know, as time goes on. So, and some of you may not even notice that I even trimmed my beard. Uh, maybe you missed the video, but my beard is, you know, like I said, I don't know, two and a half, three inches shorter than it was. And yes, I did have regret as soon as I was done. But after I was done with the video, I actually went and trimmed a little bit more. I trimmed some off the mustache then. I trimmed some more off the length. I trimmed some more back here. Uh, I just kind of hedged it up a little bit nicer like I wanted to. And then I changed my mind. It was actually exactly what I wanted was this length. Now, will I grow it back out? Yes, I'm sure I will grow it back out. But I had a lot of uh, scragglers hanging down, guys. And they were just driving me crazy. And you can look at the beginning of that video and you can see them kind of sticking out. Stuff like that. You know, sometimes we get some breakage or some of our hairs uh, in certain areas may not grow as long as others. And that'll cause you to get them long stragglers at the end uh, where some hairs, even though they're in the same area, could be here, could be here, but they're actually hanging out way longer than some of the other ones. And that there was absolutely driving me crazy. I didn't get rid of all that completely, but nonetheless, that trim did take care of a lot of that. To be honest, guys, I'm happy with the cut. Now, do I want my beard to grow back a little bit longer? Yeah, I'll probably grow it out a little bit longer and then I'll probably cut it again. You know, there was a time after I did this where I actually thought about taking it and cutting it up a little bit shorter just to get some more of those dead ends and stuff off there. But let me tell you something, guys. If you've never trimmed your beard after it's gotten that long like mine was, or even to a certain length, maybe this length, or a little bit shorter, if you went so long and never trimmed it, that first trim, it's like a blessing, man, because the comb, the brush, whatever you're, whatever you're going through your beard with, goes through it so much more smoothly, and it feels so much better, so... And it's nice to make a change every once in a while. You know, some people feel like they shouldn't cut their beard ever. They should just keep it growing. And I've been like that before, guys. But personally, I feel like a good trim is really needed, uh, especially when your beard gets longer. And uh, yeah, so that's just what I did. Do I regret it? No, I really don't. You know, like I said, in the very beginning I did. But now I don't have any regrets. I actually like the length it is now. I will probably grow it back out. But nonetheless, if I cut it, I'll probably just keep going back to probably about this length, you know, I really like this length that fits, uh, kind of fits me, I feel like, and then when it gets a little bit longer, it kind of looks like you got too much hanging off your face. In my opinion, if your beard's longer than mine, don't take that to heart, guys, that's just me talking, that's for me personally. Once it gets so long, I feel like it needs to be trimmed or really shaped, you know, especially if you're not taking care of it, so with that being said, guys, I'll see y'all in the next one. I love each and every one of y'all.